Kayla, please like and subscribe. Mm. A war. All Possibly, right. I don't know. I like the sound of that. There's been some banter back and forth, and we'll see how this turns out. Oh, no. Bugs Buddy used to say, you do know this means war. <laughs> Remember that? Bugs. Friggin' Bugs Bunny. <laughs> <laughs> All right, today I was going to talk about Holly's moon water. Oh. Oh. Do you think it has magical healing properties? Is there did something you guys try to that? Did you guys I did. Out? I did. I, I forgot. I didn't. Try. I did. I oh, saw I the did. moon and then said, "Nah, I didn't." Oh, did you know it was the strawberry? Moon? Strawberry, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. it, was, did it taste like was strawberry it? water. No, I was secretly mm -hmm. hoping it would, but it doesn't. Gotcha. Uh, Shauna uh, had the first drink. She got to it before I did. Did she Hulk it up? She had superpowers. No. no. <laughs> but she was a little quieter today, so I don't know. <laughs> Tread lightly, Greg. <laughs> I know. We'll see if she watches. Oh, yeah, right. I don't know if she'll watch oh or not, God. but just in case, just tread lightly. Yeah. Let's kick well, go south real fast. Yeah. Well, I did like to drink it a little Holly? dangerously. Yeah, uh, did I? Yeah. Did you try? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And you think there's something? You got sick. Uh, so okay. <laughs> you got sick. I feel like the, the moon, moon does you. give energy. It provides mm -hmm. energy. And that's what it is. But I think that the superpowers or the whatever comes from the power of intention. And so I think if you believe in it, it may be a thing. But is it actually like think good things are going to happen because of the moon? No. Holly. Okay. Nailed it. <laughs> I'm going to get a whole activity t-shirt for next week just because of that. Perfect. You better. I need to order a couple more. Yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. So it's all it's all placebo effect. It's all what you placebo. You yeah. think do, it, yes, and to a degree, yes. But I do believe like the energy, right? Like it charges the it, like my little crystals or my little pyramids. I put them out. And I mean, I think there is something energy wise coming from the moon, but that's where it stops, and then everything else is your own intention. So, what's the moon doing to your crystals? It's charging them. To do what? Charging them with what? To release what? some good things to me. I don't know. It's from the power of intention, or yes. from a magnetic power. Well, I think that I, I've read that it's something with magnetic and energy. Like I think. It charges them. I'm going to look it up now. Damn well, it. I, 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 I got to say, are our cells, our bodies' cells, are they nuclear? Do they have a nucleus? Yes. 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 Are they powered by electrons and protons? Yes. That's electricity. So everything's connected on that level. It's all connected. You don't, and you don't think that it doesn't have something to do? What about when these lunar cycles happen and people go cray-cray? Yeah, that is the truth. People do get a little crazy, like right before a full moon. Like I see it even on Twitter. Like it's people are a little, a little off. I mean, even myself yeah. probably. Right. Mm -hmm. I think it's a mixture of we believe what we think, but there's also more to it. Like when we we program ourselves to believe a certain way, so long, so many times we program our body to be on that vibration. That when, when different things trigger us, we go to an extreme. What do you think, Caleb? I see your, your I see some smoke I don't know. your ears. I was just saying, <laughs> I know like when you have a surgery, sometimes you can feel like a storm coming in type of thing, or you can feel the feel the rain. Like my, can, I can feel intuition. intuition. Yeah, mm -hmm. you can feel that kind of stuff. So I, I could see that you could probably feel something. I don't know what it's doing. But where does that. intuition come from? Yourself. River. My dog. Maybe, maybe from a, <laughs> something, something deeper, and it's triggering our cells to. Yeah. And then it goes to our brain, and we go, "Oh, I'm sensing something." Matt says you lost me, Greg. Uh, <laughs> you haven't you haven't blocked him, kicked him out yet. 
<laughs> no. like the, the placebo effect is real. And the only reason I know this is because I used to work in a, at a vitamin company and I used to participate in studies and we used to actually see who, who, you know, vitamins making an effect on somebody rather than a placebo. Like I actually got to see this and the placebo people sometimes felt better than the people on the actual vitamin. Really? Mm -hmm. And it's all, yes, I do believe the placebo effect is real. I've seen it myself. So, so how they explain about the, about the moon water? Because it's not crystals charging it. What, how do you get your moon water? So you just, I just, you put it in a mason jar or a, you know, something that you can cover because you don't want bugs to get in there. And then you ground it. You have to ground it in the soil, in the, in the actual dirt. And then I don't know, the moon charges my water and I drink it. I don't yeah. know why, but I've heard. It's not super moon. high tech. It's just that you put water in a jar, set it on the it's ground. Like the yeah. It's like making sun tea. It's like making sun tea. Yes, it's like making sun tea, but with my water. Yeah. And I was pretty upset it didn't taste like strawberries. Ah. Could yeah, you know? that is disappointing. Honestly, what would you do if it did taste? I would be like, holy shit. Like, I'd be mad not, that I didn't put a, a jug of water out for the strawberry moon is what right. happened. I well, think so next time we should it was just do Kool-Aid. Uh, Kool-Aid moon. moon Kool-Aid. <laughs> oh, Kool yeah. Uh, hey, if you <laughs> believed it tasted like strawberries, it probably really would have. I know, and I didn't. I mean, I just drank it. Because here's the thing. As I was told, don't use filtered water. It needs to be, like, right out of the tap. And... I don't, I'm not a lot of people know this about me, but I guess I'll just put it out there. I am the biggest water snob ever. And when I tell you I can taste the difference between waters, I'm not kidding. I mean, we've done a thing where they put different, they got different types of water and put them in cups and I didn't know. And I could guess every single one of them. And so I just chugged what? it. Yes. Pepsi Coke yes. challenge kind of thing, huh? With I water. Am, yeah. I, am. I couldn't even figure out the difference between root beer and Dr. Pepper when we did that <laughs> challenge. <laughs> I, I should be one of uh, those, like, whatever. You know how they have the wine people? They also yeah. have water people. I could totally be that. Mm -hmm. um, and Ooh. so I just chugged it because tap water, especially from here, is disgusting. Oh, my gosh. And so I didn't even give it a chance to see if it tastes like strawberries. <laughs> Frog water. No, Meg. No, it, <laughs> no, it doesn't. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Uh, wine tasting. Put, you know, so, there's wine tasting classes at the community college. No way. I just what? found that out. Co great, going back to college. <laughs> I did. I had a class there a couple weeks ago, and they said there was a wine tasting class, and I wrote that down. That was the only thing I wrote down was my notes. Really? <laughs> hmm. Bearded has a well and i can guarantee that's probably some of the best water mm -hmm. well water is good yeah. water and well they, yeah and there's like some places you know in the mountains up that have spring water that i love will you stop it? <laughs> what <laughs> who is doing that it's great can you tell by the look on his face <laughs> what i didn't hear it of what it waiting for him to do other things too you're such a pain in the butt I got my <laughs> finger on the button. Yeah. I'm never going to live the frog scenario down ever. It's, no, that's one of those things that <laughs> if you could go back in time and you just like not tell anybody. Turn back <laughs> time. Yeah. Although the story of was pretty freaking funny. I like hurt my elbow so yeah. bad. <laughs> mm. Yeah, it's okay. It's yeah. good to make people laugh even when they're laughing at you. I know. You know what? Um, it's all if good. If you can't laugh at yourself, what kind of life are you living? Yeah. True. And we're bringing back the taste test soon. Yes. Yes. Do do okay, so that's what I didn't do it this week because do we want to do it when we have guests so that they have to do it with us? Yes. Oh, we could do that. Stuff yeah, with idea. So I think yeah. that would be really fun. Um, yep. But, you know, our it next depends on what it is because it's not I always know. really fun. No, they I suffer know, with us. That's the fun when part. When you have guests, I reach out to them and I make sure they don't have any allergies. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, about that. Yeah. That. Before I she's say? sending she's sending peanut peanuts to people with peanut allergies and oh. offering them one at a time. Know, that would be. <laughs> yeah. That would be bad. No, but uh, next week um, is going to be a good one. So if this person doesn't want to come on, you're missing out because. Ever, I love these ones so 
Yeah. Okay. This person um, will be there. I have faith. He'll be there. He better be there. He will. Greg, is that all you got? I thought you were coming harder than that today. No, I was just talking about the energies of the moon. And I'll just have, water. And I'll have to say. I think there's something to it. I, and with sure. the sun, I think there's just more to things than we know. That's all. See, I think so too, but I, yeah. I, I also believe it's our, our intention, so. I think it's yeah. all. We can create with our intention, can't we? This is true. Yep. Well, I had something to fire at you, Greg, a gift, but well, I'm going to I'm going to save it cuz you didn't really push the wrong buttons today, so I'm going to save it for next what, week. What? <laughs> so, wait, wait. Okay, so I got to push a button. What kind of yeah. button? Like push conspiracy? Button, Greg. No, what you what you do last week, Greg? Yeah, I know exactly what I did. Oh, I'm, and I've got something to add to that, but I can't put it on here. Not it has to be off air. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, it's well. It's bad. It just it might they might hit us on this one. Oh uh, well, I'm going to save my my uh, retaliation then for the next time you decide to be bad, Greg. Let's well, just say let me tell you something about being bad. I do know some people have gotten like their thing, you know, the video blocked Man. only a couple of times before they totally shut oh, down their youtube altogether so we need to be careful because i'm scared we're going to get banned well, yeah so what i've been doing hard is strikes not yeah soft strikes we haven't got no. any hard strikes we oh. haven't technically got any uh copyright strikes we just they blocked us until we fixed it and so yeah. what i'm doing now is i'm testing things on my own youtube page and making sure that it works before i use it on here so we should be good to go Birthday shot. Yeah, right. birthday shot. shot for bamboo. Cheers to water. But I don't know there you go. Some, oh, there you go. There we go. Oh, I see, actually oh, got the birthday oh. shot. Well, then let's I end did. the podcast yeah. with a shot for the bamboo. Happy birthday. Yes. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Have a great week. Yes. God bless. And be kind. I'm Kayla, please like and subscribe.